Hello there, Mons, and welcome back to Echo on our server. So yeah, I've been doing a little bit of research. I mean, main thing to do anyway. Actually, it reminds me that I should have some second level upgrades, finally. I have some other things that can be sold as well. Didn't I put it on the sale? There, I have to go to Leo's place again. It has changed a lot since, so it's going to be fun. We definitely can put the new modules inside everywhere. Oh, where are those? Uh, can I take just one, please? I need to separate them because well, replacing modules is not so easy. But it does look that all the modules look the same now. Just different color from that. Which is super good because it makes more sense. And what was the third table I was thinking that I can put them in? Hmm. Was it somewhere upstairs? And yeah, just don't care about the building looks because it's really bad. And this also looks basic. I should put it in here then. What else did I have? I don't think it was the mining related. Yeah, I need to showcase you what I have done over here because there's a lot. This tool bench doesn't have. This one I just don't need. Was it something downstairs? There's the shop. Nope. In the kitchen. Because I'm not using this either, so. I remembered like I used three of those, but maybe not. Oh, did I already use up three? Hmm? Maybe I did. I don't know. Yeah, this game is a little bit odd. So anyway, let me show a little bit. So this is kind of the downstairs of my place. Yesterday I quickly just built up this. Because the thing is, if you put any industrial machinery, like even your shipyard, outside, then your outside score for the garden will be lost. I think maybe when you make the fence or something, it can be made work again, but I haven't tested it. So yeah, I didn't want my housing score to go lower than 242 because it's kind of good amounts. And yeah, <clears throat> so therefore I had to put it in the building and initially I wanted it to be on roof on, on top of the roof of this tower, but with the walls it didn't fit. So I ended up making it this way and I will, I will take everything down and make proper walls and stuff very soon probably during the weekend but yeah so down here is my small kitchen i don't even have seating do i have seating somewhere else or did i not even make the seating yet maybe not then i have to do it as well to get extra score i always thought that i had seating anyway so yeah small kitchen to get a little bit score a storage room back here because initially made the tower out of uh, adobe only i've been mining a little bit some rocks which is not so good looking at the moment on this floor i have my amazing bedroom i'm the first one who actually had bed so i slept really well and yeah next to it is my store we still have uh, own credits so instead of using like some main currency, we use this. And yeah, you can see that some people have it. And yeah, you also can understand who have joined the server, which I'm actually really happy about. And here is living room. I have my own fireplace, chimney, of course, it's a must. We had some jokes with uh, Will the other day about it. Because I asked him to add as well. He did. And then later on he was thinking about removing his. And then naming uh, the shop to uh, where's the chimney. And I was like, hmm, it doesn't sound sus enough. So what about where's Willis chimney? But yeah, I don't think we changed it yet, right? Now I'm kind of serious about the question. No, still where's Willis? Yeah. It's... A little sus, but well, not as much, so it's kind of normal. So yeah, anyway, uh, 
as you can see, I have many statues outside to kind of make the outside score nice, which is 17.23. Upstairs, I have loads of storage and forests, which I cut down pretty much daily because it's my job to make all the hewn for everyone. So yeah, on the other side, I have some more fountains and even the bond, which I try to kind of fit in using the Adobe parts as well. So yeah. And over there is my Arastra, which is outside of my area because then it doesn't affect my housing score because upstairs I have to do the changes. But I think upstairs I have something else as well. Of course, now I don't have walkway, so I have to make that as well. Take nine pieces. Let's put down those blocks. Okay, good, done. So now we can walk at least. So what did I put in this room? Ah, this is my toilets. I don't forget <laughs> that this is a room. So uh, only the latrine is available. So nothing too special. And yeah, going upstairs is only from this side. So you can go all the way here. And yeah, it nicely fits inside. It doesn't complain about being too small. And yeah, here's the storage, and that's why I couldn't fit it here. So, slightly bigger. Anyway, for this, I also have water wheel, which is quite nicely over there. And it's turning the right way, so I think either will or Dan probably change the orientation because they didn't like it going the opposite way. But let's double check. Authorization. No, it's created by me, so. How come did it change orientation overnight? I don't understand. Yesterday it was going the opposite way. Oh, who knows? Then small bridge for well to use. I mean, it's a little bit grown in, but it can be dealt with. We have the tools. Because Will is doing basic engineering. And let's quickly check also the Will's place immediately. Because it's kind of nice. He tried to do make uh, little roads, but noticed that the desert is taking the road back. Also, the totally first three pieces of stone road. Those are nicely here. Wandering Willy. Okay. Yeah, whereas Willy is right here. The store where you can buy and sell everything. I mean, I can sell those because I can make always really more. And yeah, we have so many new items that will be consumable like millstone so kind of need to fix machinery wooden gears are kind of the same but yeah a lot of stuff anyway let, let me sell those things quickly Ooh, making mortar on the back room he has well the world famous uh, fireplace that we had the discussion about the chimney and he thought that it would be quite, quite nice to have a carpet that is made out of hair belt. And yeah, he didn't realize that it's super tiny. But it's decoration after all, so... What are we to complain? And back here is uh, one of the Wainwrights. Good way to make all the necessary items for us. Toilets. It's kind of very easy access. And then finally, bedroom. Yeah, he also has study table here, so... Maybe throwing up some basic engineering diagrams and stuff. So yeah, that's all good. So anyway, I think we needed to go to Leo's place. So just to speed it up, I will quickly fly there. Because, well, why not? I can walk around as much as I want. And yeah, if you move quickly, then it goes into full Minecraft mode. Everything is very, very, very squarey. So, let's land right here. Ooh, real game online. That's nice. Might need to go to voice very soon with him. After the recording, of course. So, yeah. Uh, what Leo has done is a lot of stairs everywhere. Uh, he has the store here. Ooh. He has two stores. The food and non-food are separated now. That's really nice. We also have lubricant, which is a pain in the butt. Because... You cannot make auto, uh, like, 
anything out of it, like water wheels, windmills, they all require lubricant nowadays. It's big, big, big pain. Oh, he has also those. Might take them later. Let's sell this. And yeah, different papers that we sell and buy everywhere. Let's see more. He has the tailoring stuff here. I think the loom will come next to it so we can start making materials. He also has pottery tables, so I assume he wants to dig pottery. I will have loads of clay for it. Then back here we have staircase to the upstairs. A small living room. He also has small belt right in front. Nicely warming up, but no chimney. Uh, I need to mention to Leo that chimney is required. I know that there are no doors, but still. It's kind of tough to sit down in the corner. On this side, so empty room, then it goes into the kitchen. Two mills, two butchery tables. So yeah, a lot of food can be made here. So yeah, he's also doing butchery. And yet, there we've been. So upstairs, some new rooms are being made. This is the bedroom. It's huge, the bedroom. And yeah, he also has the bed now. The dresser looks so much nicer now in version 11 than in version 10. And I think downstairs there were a few more, more places. Little downstairs we have decorations, of course. He got those from Will. And this is all the gathering and farming stuff. Because, yeah, he has the hydro hydroponics. Those tables I can make. So, yeah. It's interesting. It shows me green, but, yeah. I don't have dev tools, so I cannot forcefully enter. But yeah, those are really useful to make some more plants, especially when you're working with plants that do not grow in your uh, area. Or if they go extinct. He also has a lot of uh, huckleberries. Nice. He has small mine, not too big because, well, he's not minor. And yeah, that's pretty much all he has. And yeah, as I mentioned before, then... Uh, oh, where is it? So yeah, he has made a lot of stairs. They go everywhere. It's nice. So yeah, you can go around and just enjoy. But let's go and check what Dan has made because, well, I've, I haven't been there for, like, at all. Oh, Will sold me some stuff. That's fine. So, first of all, he has a wolf on the roof, which is nice. And then there is all this. Again, it shows screen when it shouldn't be. I don't know why. This game has some bugs. And I think the doors are all locked, right? Yeah. I might need to get the dev tool only for that. So this way we can just ignore the authorization. Which is good. <laughs> Because I'm not willing to fly through. It's probably coming useful later on as well when something else goes wrong. But yeah, not for building or anything. So yeah, he has really big research room. So doing a lot of stuff. He also has a mine downstairs. It's Adobe everywhere. A lot of staircases going down. I think yesterday he was dealing with Waterville power system as well what is in this room smeltery and we can finally get items from him and yeah really big mine oh yeah it's quite nice going quite far away and on this side yeah just sand and limestone so nothing too special yeah he he kind of seems to love doing this type of stuff oh another bloomery okay nice more mining around it. Nice. And we are getting stuck for no reason. Anything else hidden here? Nope. There is not. And yeah, a lot of storage. Because, well, we always need storage for everything. Yeah, there's nothing there. At least we can't see anything. Now going back upstairs. I think maybe we can go and find some other places inside. So back here we have very small room. 
It's considered bedroom with no bed, no dresser. Then we have toilets. It's kind of interesting that a lot of seating for the toilet, but I mean, being like more scientific, maybe it's good to gather some ideas here. I mean, some people go to the bars. Here is the kitchen with all the campfire. I mean, it's good. Would need some type of chimney for the campfire though, but okay. And back here we have living room slash store. No chimney though. Again, have to mention that. And his shop has nails, which is good because he definitely will need a lot of nails. So I will take some. I mean, I don't know how many I can take. I only have one. Ooh. So I can't take that many of those. I have to accept this way. <laughs> I need to come back with more stuff because the Dendrology Advanced I can bring here. Yeah, I might sell it later. They need definitely those as well, so I need to come back. No questions asked. But yeah, it's otherwise it's quite nice building. He also has the mountain chest because iron. I wonder what he has inside. Ah, water wheels, some other chests. Ooh, he also has cooking utensils nice yeah some stuff of course many tools are already broken and yeah it's not really worth uh, re repairing those tools that much because once they break and you fix them they don't really go all the way up anymore so yeah max durability has been reduced by past repairs this is constant and it goes down 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 a lot once you just feel that if it's less than half of the original durability, you just chuck it and make a new one. So it's kind of true to the real life, but yeah, it doesn't make people happy. So <laughs> it's a lot of extra work. And I really want to see where he was doing the water stuff all under here. Here, I can't really see anything. I didn't want to have tool. I wanted to fly. Now I have two devtools. Okay, so it's all closed up. That's why we can't see it. But yeah, he made the water wheel system. And yeah, sometime in the past, we could put three water wheels next to each other and they all work. But I think it was already in Echo 10 fixed that uh, every water wheel requires solid uh, side, at least one side. So you can put two next to each other, but not three. So yeah, at least it's making some power. And now let's get out and back to our place, which is nice, but requires a lot of work. So yeah, that's pretty much what is happening. And yeah, just so I do not forget, I will drop this and then I will smite it. If I can. Oh, okay, there it goes. So I have taken one dirt out. So move this here and just replace the roads. Yeah, I don't know why it decided to go wonky. But yeah, I don't want to use it at all, if possible, because it is not the right tool for us. It's only used for, well, opening closed doors and fixing sometimes something if it's too wrong. But yeah, otherwise, no cheating in the server. And yeah, when I try to de-cheat something it was a little bit wonky but it's nothing too serious i guess i can always spawn in one more piece of this and yeah all equal but yeah anyway that's all i wanted to give an update i hope more people will come because so far it has been all good i haven't heard any complaints which is good but if something goes wrong then of course i will need to focus on that I'm not sure when I will move the server to my office because it is kind of stable in my house plus I have much better access. So we'll see about that. But yeah, just come on and join and well, let's let's enjoy Echo 11 and find out what big crimes are in stock other than just everything requiring all the parts that will go bad. Yeah, just to show you how it works 
we go here and we go parts and you can see this has the millstone currently still fully working but but i haven't done much work either so that's why anyway thank you very much for watching and i will see you in the next one bye